Last year, the Conservative Government of Australia moved to delist the Tasmanian wilderness as a World Heritage Site so that it could be logged. Our partner, the Australian Conservation Foundation, helped to mobilize a massive campaign against this move. The government's bid failed. The Tasmanian wilderness is still a protected site. The ACF is an environmental advocacy organization. Uh, they work, uh, when the environment is threatened, they email their constituents and encourage them to take political action to make change. They use email not because it's the most effective means of communication, but because it's the most efficient. This summer, we are working with the ACF to make this most efficient means of communication more effective. We're doing this by modeling the, uh, yeah, until this summer, the, the screen is blank. Until this summer, <laughs> the ACF, uh, when they send out an email, would only see information at the aggregate level about that email's performance. This is an example dashboard. Although it looks fancy, all it really tells you is that the longer you wait, the more people will open your email. <laughs> Behind this dashboard is information about individual people's actions at every stage of the pipeline, from receiving the email, to opening the email, to clicking on a link in that email, to taking action, whether the action is to volunteer, to donate, or to write to your representative. We're working with the ACF to increase the number of people moving from each stage of this pipeline to the next, to increase political action and we're modeling both the constituents and the emails to achieve this goal. For each constituent, we're producing a list of predictions of how that person is likely to act in the future using data on their past behavior and demographics. The ACF can use these lists of predictions to identify their most highly engaged constituents and learn how to better target them in future campaigns. For the email model, we want to know which features of the email have the most effect on that email's click-through rate and open rate. We're modeling features of the subject line, like its length or whether it's a question, and also features of the email body, like whether it has a political theme or refers to a specific geographic area. For each of these features, when our model suggests that it has an influence on the email's success, the ACF can test that by sending out two emails that differ only in that feature to verify the effect. So for example, our model says that when you ask people for money, the email will perform worse than an email where you ask for some non-financial kind of action. The ACF can test this prediction by running an experiment on ask type. Our models are general and we hope that they'll be adopted by other nonprofits who also run email campaigns. The ACF can use our work to use their data to optimize their email practices and increase political activism to protect the environment. Thank you. <laughs>